The Sherwood Animal Shelter has a packed house right now. In the last month, 50 dogs arrived at the Sherwood Animal Shelter, pushing the shelter to capacity. Workers fear if the animals aren't adopted soon, they may have to do something they've avoided for the last three years. THV 11's Laura Monteverdi explains. Denise, the shelter posted on their Facebook yesterday calling for the public's help. They say they've run out of room and out of options and may be forced to euthanize dogs. Hello! At the Sherwood Animal Shelter, you can find almost any breed of dog you can imagine. An entire variety. We have anything from little bitty rat terriers to shih tzus to big old German Shepherds and I mean it's a variety of them. You never know what we're going to be given. She's been here since the 4th of August. But lately the shelter has been given more than it can handle. In this year alone we've had over 430 animals brought in just dogs and over 180 cats. In the last three days the shelter has taken in 17 dogs including this little girl and with 30 of the 31 kennels filled there's not much room to go around. The last empty cage. We haven't euthanized in space for two and a half years, so we work really hard with rescue groups and fosters. But if it comes down to it, sometimes a decision has to be made. Oh, it's okay. The shelter says a lot of the animals that come through the door are strays. But many others have been turned in by their owners, unable to care for them. Getting a dog is a major decision. It's not something you want to just jump into without knowing what you're getting into. People need to take into consideration when picking out a pet, you know, does your lifestyle really fit the animal you're trying to get? But for some, the decision is easy. If I take one dog home, that's one less dog that's going to get used. We definitely need adoptions and we definitely want to get these animals forever homes. Oh, him's a good boy. Him's a good boy. Now there's good news. The shelter is waiving the adoption fees until Friday. And if you aren't able to adopt, donations are just as important. We have all the info for you on THV11.com.